Hello fellow YouTubers, and welcome back to Master Loves for Doom 2. This is... Uh, Blood Sea Keep. Oh. You're once the biggest and baddest cyber demon to rule hell. Betrayed by a council, the Cabal, you find yourself victim to the utmost humiliation. Morphed into a human, of course you're out for revenge on the, the Cabal. Blood Sea Keep is a home of your past advisor, the... Um, bit, the something... After being dumped into the sea of blood, following your humiliating transformation into a human, you swim until you come to the Keep Pier. All who enter Blood Sea Keep fall victim to your former's advice favourite pastime. Torture. One being me, because I'm about to play this map. Let's get this over with already. Start off with a pump shotgun, and that's all you're going to get for the vast majority of this map. Take out these imps. I got all these shotgunners up here. Why don't you just get your fish mouth sniped from all angles? Take care of that pinky, that in, flipping that switch, which will lower the red key. Run to get that. I'm gonna run back up there now. Grab the chainsaw. All oh, the demons out. Not good. Now I need to run over here and collect the armour just as a little safety blanket. Take out these stupid freaking shotgunners. And then run over here. We're gonna empty this room out for later. Collect the blue key and we're not collecting that invulnerability yet. We desperately need it for a part later on where we'll get some useful weapons. Oh no, I'm gonna die, am I? Again. I'll just manage to pull off the set of sexual practice running this map, that's why the lights are on, because it's done that freaking long. I'm just gonna grab these health bonuses, I know it seems like a waste, because we're at 5% health, but yeah. A lot of lost souls in this map as well, which makes it worse the fact, considering the fact we're on cheesy doom. We're all mandatory to kill. But I don't know how to get this map working with GL doom. I have no, no idea. Some smart people know how, but I'm not one of those. Unfortunately. Go into here, there are three lost souls in here and a cacodemon in the middle, which has, hasn't been raised up just yet. Jump over him. Go brush his pearly white teeth. Keep him in check. Go to the dentist. Oh, probably be in dentist for like a minute, maybe. Now. You'll let a pain and lentil, but it's going to be one of them boring videos where it takes map slow as frick. Cheer on. Madam. What do you think brushing too? Girls are going to look pretty, don't they? Ow. Oh. Take that shotgun in there. Open that door. Some imp, an imp, and a spectre will teleport in. No trouble. Flip the switch, and down there will be another pain on Try get. Now she's teleporting. Okay. That sucks. And well, we're gonna go over there now. Yeah. Switches. Ah, we actually have a, pow a decent weapon. 
Now we can take on that pesky Baron. It's going quite well this one, this run. Well, I don't want to speak too soon. We need to go back up there as well, I don't know why I jumped down. Dead. Just gonna open this door and brush... Well, brush those invisible teeth. Alright, we're actually making quite a decent bit here, do I? This is going quite well. Now, I remember that invulnerability that I said I'll save. I don't know why I want to save it. Because down there, it's going to get pretty sweaty and dangerous, so... Hmm, done this the wrong way. Yeah, I had a pr practice run this map, this is... Ugh. It's just, I think it's an RNG. RNG, ba heavily RNG based, this map. Sometimes it can go swimmingly, sometimes it can just all fall to pieces. Yeah, I'm gonna grab the invulnerability, run back up here, get the radiation suit, and we're gonna go outside. Yep, facing him. Mancubus facing him without the invulnerabilities. It's suicide. That's not what I wanted to happen, to be honest with you. That's how it goes, though. That's how this map, this disaster of a map goes. We're going to strafe around the whole perimeter of the castle thing. And make sure all the lost souls are dead, otherwise we'll be starting this map all over again. Right, Radsit's running out, so... If, if, no, they're all of them are dead. It's not a question if they're not dead. They all are dead. I saw it in my own eyeball poles. We'll jump down here once again. I should have done this the first time round. Grab the yellow key, otherwise I won't be able to finish the stage and I'm going to be mad at myself. Now, we can finally make a bit of progress. That that Baron, see that Baron? You see him right, don't you? Choke tester. Teleported the other way. Now, take care of these two imps. Okay. Bye, imp. Don't want to be with anyone. It's not like I wanted to be with you or anything. Baka. And I'll stop. I'll stop saying that. I'm making it all cringe, probably. <laughs> we go into here. The Hell Knight. Looking at the super shotgun, can't take her off. He's dead. Two lost souls as well. Should have completely forgot about. And they're dead too. Shoot that corpse to open the door back up. And now we're just going to run. And get bitten or clawed, whatever. That sound even is anymore. Now, this is probably the most dangerous room in the game. Oh. Oh. Star is the most dangerous thing in the existence of mankind. Yep, we have to take it slow, unfortunately. As much as I want to go fast, map this dangerous, it's not worth it. Yep, this is a fourth secret, I think I've got all the secrets now. No? The chain gun, the... Uh, the map, the, yeah, I've got all secrets here. Yeah. Take care of all the caged enemies, and that one opened. Oh, we can open these. Oh, okay. I'm a dummy. Didn't know that. I'm just gonna get to like 30. I'll do. Now, one last trial of this room is: do not get crushed by these freaking crushers. Because if I get crushed, I'm gonna scream.
Und denke, Crosser da ab Screen. 100 enemies, yep. Into the blue door. Brushes two. Laid his teeth. That went off quite well. I think a hit went off perfectly. Well, it's far too soon, of course. But you know what? We're home free. We're actually done with the hardest parts of the map. That last trial, take care of these Hell Knights. I don't want to save my rockets, so I'll not bother using any more. Now the cru some more crusher action. There's a strategy for these, believe it or not. First one, you just run in, hide under the little alcove. And the crusher rises back up, you run back out. I mean, th they're not damaged floors, but with cranium they might, may as well be. This one's a bit different. You've got to run in, flip the switch and run back out. Bones were tensing up on that one. Same strategy as the first crusher. Run in, hide on the alcove, wait for it to... This one's fast though, so you got to be a bit quicker. Oh, this one is... Sadism, serve it on a silver plate. Run in. Pinkies will rise out of the alcoves. You can wait for the crushers to come down, but it might, might not always happen. They might come onto the platform. Now, after those two are dead. After those two are dead, you hide under this corner. Flip that switch and run back out, and then GG. You've done a crusher puzzle. Now, there's one last thing to take care of. That, of course, is an arch file. That's why I saved the rockets, everyone, even though he's not cooperating this time. Now he's dead. I flip this switch. There's a switch behind this chair. But you can cheese it. I don't know the exact method of... The, uh... Yeah, that'll eventually open up. And we are done with Blood Sea Keep. Done. But you know what? It gets worse after this, don't worry. The map itself, design wise, it's pretty good, you know, like a blood river. Blood, blood river. I really like that idea, you know, like a little castle grounds. It's neat design, honestly. It's pretty good for a 1995 wood, design wise, but just the execution is just god awful. It's ridiculously hard, there's no. It's not fun to play because of the freaking weapons. It's incredibly t the starter is incredibly tedious. It's just sadistic and oh, cranium's like like we've got Kristen Clee who's like a lawful evil. We've got Drake O'Brien from TNT who's a neutral evil. Then we've got cranium's chaotic evil. If you want a little D and D alignment chart, then give me a bob. I'm glad this is done, but next map is not an, any better. Mephisto's Mausoleum. Oh dear. Let's see how disastrously this one will go, which I'll do in a second. This is Lewis the Inspensable signing out. Goodbye.